All right, all this water is going to be my cargo. One fell down. Okay. Don't go nowhere. All right, so look at this, look at this, look at this. I got panniers for the front. And yes, they are the black roller on the front, but whatever, you know. Uh, just got them in, the, did the REI Memorial Day sale thing, that and one of these a delta stem riser stem extension handlebar riser something like that i don't know but it's brought my handlebars from you know down here to up here so maybe that will prevent the uh fingers going numb that i was experiencing we'll see and Hopefully I put those nuts and bolts on tight enough. I love it. The instruction says tighten, but don't over tighten. I'm like, yeah, how vague can we be? Uh, ran into a slight issue when trying to pull this stem off of here. I raised it up and my front brake cable was like, nope, no slack. So I kind of pulled on it a little too hard and it like hyper extended it or something. It like locked in my front brake. <laughs> I'm like, oh great. But I just kind of pushed this cable back down and it freed my freed my brake up down there. So that that and I got one of these. New helmet. Yeah. Uh, visor a flat ish spot up here so I can mount my GoPro all right so I'm gonna put all this water in these bags button it up and do my ride oh my goodness look how dirty Bonton is I haven't cleaned it since I brought it back from trail days it's a dirty bike I get it clean though Another one bites the dust. Oh well. I do have my tire kit in that bag, but I'm uh I'm about a mile from home, so I guess I'm up for a little walk. Okay, not only did that nail come in through the bottom of the inner tube right here, but made it all the way through the inner tube and put four or five holes right here next to the valve stem so I don't think I'm going to attempt to patch this alright it's about as ready for rag bri as it's going to get uh, I have the panniers I just have them off for right now That's A2. He's a crawfish, you know, from New Orleans. So I don't know if he's going to ride there the whole trip, but that's where he's going to sit for now. The Sun 28 Dynamo Hub. Uh, all my cables run. Bicycle Michaels in New Orleans. You know, really set this bike up from the ground up, complete build. Uh, we got a we got a little cluster of cables here, but I mean, eh, they're all tucked away. Plenty of slack if I ever decide to move this front light somewhere. That's the front light. It throws a pretty good beam. Uh, got an Ortlieb handlebar bag. And the plug to charge USB devices while I'm driving, while I'm rolling. What else have I put on it? They had to change the, the heads up, the tube riser, handlebar riser I had and just wasn't gonna jive with this plug, so they had to change this thing out for me. So this is a, this is a little bit different here. 
a lot of water storage uh, that's upside down but I got this pump because it's pretty neat it's a pretty neat pump this cap comes off and I can't spin it with one hand but this piece right here twists and spins and basically the tube is inside this tube comes out and you screw it into the bottom and you, you know, go to town uh, Abus bike lock this craziness um, yeah so hopefully if and when I put my bike somewhere it's there when I come back for it tighten that up a little bit more and a little tail light real bright real bright tail light back there and I have a solar panel that I'm going to fit across my my bedroll that's back here solar panel on top of that to charge a small brick some cords running across with the panniers on both sides of course the Brooks B17 you know still working on that oh and I uh one of them just cuz this water bottle is going to change because it's it's riding on my the back of the fender and when they when they rebuilt they rebuilt my front wheel from the hub out hub of course shoulder spokes and a new whatever that is maverick mavic rim i don't know so probably after rag or you know a year from now i'll have them rebuild the, the back with something nice in it and i'm still riding on the continental tour rides that came with the bike because i think they still got some some life left in them at least enough for rag 440 more miles of the thousand miles that I wanted to get before Ragbri, I'm sorry to say I only did about 800 of those. Uh, this last month has been one heck of an adventure. Uh, if you see my truck behind the bike there, it's kind of two-toned because I was working one day and the guy decided to, you know, hey, it'd probably be a good idea if we just run into the back of this guy. So my truck was messed up. I was out of work for a bit. Uh, their insurance, you know, really done one over on me, and uh, um, hey, my, I had to just do this myself. I'll put in some pictures, and My truck works again. It's got tail lights. It's got most of a bumper, and I'm able to work with it again. I just need to get the bed liner back in the truck. But that's neither here nor there. We're talking about rag bra in my bike now. So that's what it is. I didn't get my rag bra information packet until the 11th, and it's kind of funny because in the in the papers it says be sure to have all your reservations you know done by the first okay I don't know how you expect me to do that when you don't send it to me until I get it on the 11th but all right yeah so we we made some calls and uh, I got Port Belly Ventures they're gonna bring me from the end town to the starting town so I'm gonna ride to I guess Davenport in my truck on um, I got to be there for Friday for noon so I can park the truck at three o'clock the charter is gonna leave Davenport bring me and my bike to the starting town and then I'll just hang out Friday night Saturday night 
you know, until we, we kick off on Sunday. I think there'll be an expo. I can look at a lot of shiny things, meet people, eat food, do all that good stuff that you do at Ragbri, and get going from there. I do have my Ragbri attire, my jersey. Of course, I'm not wearing it right now because I just got home from work. And yeah, I'm excited, a little nervous, but mostly excited. Crazy bit of anxiety working in there, but you know, that's, that's just to be expected. I'm sure it'll be fun. I'm sure it'll be an adventure and I'm sure it'll be hot. <laughs> but yep. I'm still alive, everybody. I'm still alive. I was just out of the loop for a minute.